My first assignment overseas was 740th Tank Battalion. And we got caught up in the bones. Found out that we were supposed to go to this town in Belgium, which we went to. Neuf Chateau was the name of it. It was colder than the devil, for one thing. On the 16th of December, they, they said that the Germans had broken through and uh, they want us to go somewhere. And we said, well, wait a minute, we don't have any tanks. Said, oh, well, we'll get some for you. So they sent us out to look for them at some of the ordnance depots. And they were all mostly busted up tanks that had been shot up and what have you. Well, we put together three tanks and a tank destroyer. And they sent them off down to stop the first SS Panzer Division of all things at the town of Stumont, the railroad station there. And uh, they stopped it. They stopped the first SS Panzer Division with uh, three tanks. They knocked out the three leading tanks of the first SS Panzer. And uh, they turned around and left. Meanwhile, uh, I was in the assault gun We were firing from Chateau in uh, Stumont to the town of, uh, of Leglise. We flattened it just as the first SS turned around and tried to come through that way. So uh, that was a continuing battle then from then on. We got to, to the uh, Siegfried line and crossed out. We were the 82nd Airborne all the time. But uh, yeah, they were, they were all over. They liked riding on tanks because that meant they could get up out of the snow, you know, and ride for a while instead of walking. We tried to go back over to Europe every year or two. Uh, we go to the town where we were stationed there in Belgium and started all of it. But then we travel around where we were, you know, everywhere we hit if we can. And there's only six of us left that can make it to the reunion zone out of about 800 originally. And of course the grand grands kids and grand and and sons and daughters are there, and uh, they're always interested in knowing what happened. They know their father was there. They don't know where he was. Sometimes they'll know one town or two towns that he mentions. And if we can help them, you know, about telling about what happened there, while well, we do that, that's that's the best part.